Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. On today's show, we'll take a look at our nation's booming oil industry. With the help of our Minister of Oil, we recorded the following. Just a moment. I have some very important news to share. <gasps> You're kidding me. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go live to our reporter at the wall. Beatrice, can you hear me? Yes, Sonia. I'm here at the wall where an attack has just happened. With me is Darren, who witnessed the event. I'm on? Yeah. So I was sleeping in my tent when I heard a bang, like a big explosion, you know. When I got out, I saw a huge fire at the wall. Do you know what caused the explosion? I, I think a truck smashed into it. That's right, Sonia. A brigade truck crashed into the wall, killing a teenager on the spot. Nah, you got it wrong. The truck didn't kill the teen. Border forces did. They're shooting kids all the time. Hey, don't grab my mic. Uh-oh. Looks like we're having some technical difficulties. Wish I could say I'm surprised the brigades are behind this, but I can't. Thank you for your report, Beatrice. Have no fear. The authorities will ensure nothing like this occurs on Election Day. Remember, I'll be there live. Now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. As we approach Election Day, more and more protests are occurring in our fine country. Don't support the violence. Vote for Tyrak. As you know, The Sonia Show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonia Hotline. And that has been The Sonia Show. your tapes and snacks here. Tapes and snacks. Huh. She says she's different from Tyrak, but give us some power and then we'll see. You're one of them, huh? Sorry, kid. I got nothing. Second, would you? Take a break, Joe. You seem pissed off. I am. I hire a bartender, and he fails to show on the first day. Any chance you want to fill in for me? 
I already have one awful job. I don't need another. Aren't you a little young? Wait, hold on. I don't care if you're a goddamn fetus. Wanna make some money? Goddamn right. Hear that? We got ourselves a teen bartender. Couldn't be worse than you. Screw you, Debbie. Okay, kid. The key to bartending is never losing your cool. I'll be in the kitchen scrubbing dishes. The dishwasher didn't show either. The world is full of degenerates. More motherland spirits. Hey, kid! What desert Same. draft? What's the hold up on my desert draft? I want a desert draft! My boyfriend broke up with One me! One tyrant room. Thanks. Here's a tip. Go buy yourself some diapers. So, where's my tyrant brew? Shot of Homeland Hops. I had a long day. Thanks, kid. Here you go. Hey, kid! Where's my what Homeland Hops? Hops? Where's my yes, Desert Draft? Homeland Hops. Thanks. What's the hold up on my desert draft? Thanks. So, Here's a tip. Where's Go my buy yourself some group? diapers. Yes, I'll leave you a tip.
looks like a kid. But here, you deserve this. Now, make me another. a drink named after me. Thanks. You're at the TV. Ten year commemoration for the victims of the attack is coming up. My daughter was one of the poor souls who died under those rocks. Well, bad things happen sometimes, don't they? Oh, finally done with the dishes, kid. Jesus, these people are disgusting. Anyway, thanks for the help. Here's a meal on the house. Jared, I didn't see you there. Kid, uh, you should go. It's uh, getting late. Ah, oh, damn, it's been a lousy day. Lost my credit card, too. Another round, Jared? Yeah, last round, Joe. I did. And how does that make you feel? Oh, is he still our president? Thanks for stopping, young blood. Mr. Grizzly broke down. I need to find a phone to make a call. I got this map here. You, uh, you see a little truck? That's where we are now. Get me to a phone, and there's some dough in it for you.
Come on, let's go. So, young blood, where were you headed before picking me up? Guess you got a foreign work permit, huh? Don't worry, I'm on your side. I did. Makes me sick them saying the brigades did it. And what about you? What do you think? <sighs> I wish I could 100% agree, but I've seen many politicians come and go. Oh, the roads in this country! Shitters in the middle of nowhere. Petrian tax revenue hard at work. Hope you're good at reading maps. We need to find a working phone booth. Let's roll! We gotta find a phone. I don't like leaving my rig alone like that. Go just up the road a ways. Yep, but a lot of people are looking for my truck. I've marked the roadblock on the map. Come on, let's ride. No time to waste, young cub. Ah, uh, gotta be a phone around here somewhere. You call. That's good. Phone booth. Good job, young blood. Wait a minute. I'll be quick. Robert, can you hear me? Robert! Can you hear me? Robert! God damn it! Mm. We're losing time, young blood. I gotta get to a phone. Time to waste, young cub. Just a huge tree covering the road. I'll make a note on the map. Damn Petrian infrastructure. Any phone booths nearby? Let's roll! Another abandoned construction. Tyrak and his cronies should be locked up. Which direction should we head in to find a phone booth? I hope we find a phone, and soon. A phone booth? Good work! Wait a sec, I'll be quick. Hello? Robert? Yeah, we have a problem. The truck broke down. 
Yeah, right there. Yeah, the transmitter's all right. Right. Yeah. Fine. I'll be there. Yeah, thanks. No, I didn't. Understand me? Now let's get back to Mr. Grizz. Hopefully he's all right. Everything's here, young blood. What a relief. My friends will be here soon. You should go, okay? Here's the dough I promised. Thanks, young blood. And your secret is safe with me, too. I wish you luck on this grand adventure of yours. Can I help you? Oh no, she's back. Just act cool, okay? Sorry to interrupt. Mind if I have a word with you, kid? 
I'll explain everything in my room. How is it looking, Fanny? Almost ready. I'm on the trail of the Brigade transmitter. Heard about it? The Brigades have a transmitter they're using to broadcast anti tyrak propaganda. Naturally, it's highly illegal. These guys are terrorists, you know? What about the attack in 86? Look, I believe the person moving it frequents this motel. In fact, I think he or she was here last Sunday. Good question. The guests here don't talk to cops. Truth is, I think some of them are brigades. I don't know exactly. Maybe the clerk back there. To be transparent with you, the brigades tried to kill me not long ago. And I'd really like to bust up their comms. I knew I could count on you, kid. Everything you need is on the wall. Take it. Here's how it's gonna work. We've almost identified the perp, but we need to be sure. Talk to the guests and scribble out the ones that don't match. Come back when you've narrowed them down. Got it? Got any more questions before we begin? Anything at all? It should have never happened. That's what I think. Guess I know who your favorite candidate is, don't I? Okay, let's get going. way you're done already. Come back later. Hello. What can I do for you? I was. Yes. Yes. I remember him well, in fact. He was handsome. A big man with short hair, large hands, strong hands. You don't have his number, do you?
sec. Took your sweet time. Hey, where's my salad? Then who does? I was. Oh yeah, I tried avoiding him. He frightened me. He was the same age as me, and I don't consider myself old. You don't think I'm old, do you? That hurts. What you're doing? Oh, you've crossed out all the portraits? Then forget everything I've just said. joke, kid? You crossed out every single sketch. I hope not. We got sketches of this guy up everywhere. What do you mean what will happen? Prison. This person plays an important role in a terrorist organization. We don't take that lightly. You there, ex-mom? Hold on. I gotta take this. Ex-mom, I just saw the game I made. That's wonderful, baby. You're still being careful out there, right? Don't start, please. Sorry. So, how is your search going? My search? Oh, really well. Yeah, uh, I'm finding out a lot about my bio parents. They were, uh, really impressive people. Smart, kind. I think of a lot like them. Oh, well, I'm glad to hear it. You are smart and kind. Look, I gotta go. I'll call you soon, okay? Take care of yourself, honey. I will. Bye. Bye. What was all that racket? How people ever get any R&R &R in places like this is beyond me. Well, thanks for your help, but I gotta clean up here. Say, have I seen you someplace before? Hmm. Anyway, take this. It's not a lot, but you deserve it for your help. Take care of yourself, okay? The roads can be mean.
Hey, homegirl. You're wondering what I'm doing. Just hacking into Super Supper to give everyone in Petria a free burger. Those capitalist pigs need to spread a little wealth around. What about you? I figured you were trying to leave this despotic dump. Good luck with that, homegirl. Well, guess I'll get back to hacking this burger megacorp. You should take a snooze on that gnarly pillow behind you. Gonna need energy for the road. and ears and an IQ of 180. Yo, what happened is awful. Really think the brigades did this? My sentiments exactly. They got too much power. Know what I'm saying? Alex, you there? I'm here. There's a receiver inside. Not bad, right? Built it myself. This is safe, Alex. Totally safe, Mr. Ursus. Like always. He's a friend. I'm helping him in his club in exchange for info. Info on my bio parents. They were in his club, too. I'm about to switch on the you know what, Alex. And I need to know if there are any uh you know what in the area. Look, I'm gonna level with you. Maybe it's stupid to do so, but I feel like I can. Mr. Ursus has an illegal radio. And he wants me to check on the cops, to see where they are. I heard that, Alex. Guess the cat's out of the bag. Sorry, Mr. Yu. Can't help you today. Too busy trying to make it rain beef. No worries, because... Homegirl here on the bus can. Don't worry, yo. It's simple. Even an adult could do it. Go ahead. Turn the scanner on. Cerebral flatulence. Forgot the bats. Here. Just gotta put them in the right way. No sweat. radio.
you. When are you gonna tell me more about my parents? That's part of the deal. About that, Alex. Uh... Yo, you're picking something up. Unit 8, you copy? Alva. Unit 8 here, camped outside the gas station. Not a for now. Over. Keep looking. You got donuts? Alva. Coast is clear, Mr. Yu. They're still at the old spot. Broadcast away. Yeah, Mr. Yu finds spots where he can do his little radio show. You should hear his radio voice. <laughs> Cracks me up, man. Thanks, eh? And, uh, homegirl, beside, eh? And Alex, make sure you reach out to your mom, okay? I'm sure she misses you. <sighs> sure, whatever. Thanks, homegirl. Here, for your help. Now, time to give the citizens of Petria free beef! And boom! Oh no! Trojan horses down! Well, at least 347 people got free burgers. I can live with that. Next up coming up. See you around, homegirl. Stay fresh. And good luck out there. Inside so long, I've lost sight of red and wrong. When you left an open door, I couldn't help but explore. So I took off with no plan, thinking I could find a friend.
Welcome aboard, kid. When you left an open door, I couldn't help but explore. So I took off with no plan. Thinking I could find a friend. Saying hi and shaking hands. A couple of weeks now, but it feels longer than that. You? Hmm. Are you frightened? I know it's tough, but try not to think about it. What you should do now is rest, if you can. You'll feel better. while you were asleep.
In just a few days, the nation will honor the victims of 86 and elect its new president. When historians look back on this September 9th, many will consider it the most important day ever in the history of Petria. It's perfect. The entire country will be watching. I agree. The time to act is now. Intelligence says the brigades will try something, Mr. President. If they do, I'll crush them once and for all. Of course, I'll be here all day, reporting live at the scene. This has been Sonia Sanchez for GNN. And cut! <laughs> you do her hair, is that it? I don't do her hair. Don't be offended. We think her hair is great. Look, Sonia's not seeing anyone right now, all right? Hi, kid. This guy won't let us see Sonia. He thinks we're fans. Aren't we, Stan? We're... we're more than that. We're her biggest fans. Nice one, Stan. Yeah. yeah, you heard the kid. And who are you? Yeah, who are you, kid? Well, whoever you are, get out of here. That goes for you two also. Come on, Mitch. We made the hairstylist upset. We'll talk to Sonia later. Oh, are you crying, Sonia? A girl. Dad here. In 86. Might as well do it now. This is for you, Lola. Lola was her name. I, I, I tried. I tried to save her. But, but the rocks, they, they kept coming. It's just, sometimes, I wish I had died. And she lived. Oh, Sonia. Mitch, behind the rocks. You see what I'm seeing? Uh-huh. Come on! Stop right there! You again. Wait, where's the other one? Mitch, the beast! <laughs> what the? Woohoo! We got him, Mitch! We got the would-be killer! Woohoo! Wait, you know these two s and guys? No, them. They're the big brothers! Hi, Sonia. Oh, hi, Sonia. You two come here and give me a hug. Now! <laughs> right away, yeah. ma'am. On our way. It's so good to see you two. It's been too long. Want to rain on your family reunion, but who's gone? Not a problem. We'll be here on election day if he comes back. Yeah, we'll be here. Stan, oh, Mitch. Oh, I'm sorry I've been so distant. I hope you can forgive me. Don't worry about it, Sonia. Yeah, don't worry. We're a family. Aw, oh, you guys are the best. Give me another hug. That leaves just the brigades. Time to cut the head off the snake. Snakes and drinks? Can I help you at all? Mm -hmm. 
don't know who Stan it'd be if it wasn't. Kid, you've got to be smarter than that. Security is all over the place. They'll send you to you know where. And my wife and I, we'll end up in prison. Can we trust you? Okay. You seem in good health. Maybe try crossing over the peak. There's a path to the right of the trucks. But be careful. One false step and that's it. I hope you find your freedom, kid. We'll be rooting for you. for the offshore worker exam. Are you registered? Mm. Everything looks in order. You can head inside. citizens will pass. Your number will be displayed behind me. When it appears, it's your turn. Your test results will also be displayed there. So pay attention. There are certain requirements you need to know. Only married persons with at least one child can rightfully apply. Your contract, if you pass, will last for five years. No more, no less. Lastly, the majority of your pay will be sent back to your homeland. Your number will soon be displayed. Bless our beautiful nation. What are you doing? Your number's on the screen. Get in there. Ready? Quiet. Let us begin. Question one. What is your candidate number? Question two. How old is your eldest child? Strange. You look very young. Question three. If you pass, how long will your stay abroad be? Question four. What age would your eldest child be when you return from abroad? Excuse me. Well, how much are you offering? Question five. Are you, or have you ever been, a Black Brigade? Question six. Have you ever listened to illegal radio stations? Be honest. Question seven. When did the Black Brigade terrorist attack occur? Ah! 
question nine. Who is our great president? Question 11. Which of the following do you enjoy the most? You have answered all the questions. Petria is a democratic country, so you have the opportunity to ask at this time a question of your own. It's good not to ask questions. You can now wait for your test results in the waiting room. Hopefully you'll not be arrested. Good day. You look young to take this test. Oh? Don't worry, I won't say anything. I hope he passes us. Number 13, you have passed. Stand up and leave. And may you well represent our blessed nation. Freedom. Nothing is more important, but there are many others in Petra still looking for it. Their journeys have only just begun.